Have you ever wondered if you could gather all your useful information in one place, using only the blockchain, and still be able to place several cryptocurrency wallets and all your social networks? That's right, this is another Nulls novelty with its Nabox multi-chain wallet. For those who still don't know, Nulls is a project that has been around since 2017 and hasn't stopped in time. If you stop to see all the things that this project's team is doing, you'll realize that the project is bringing several solutions not only to your network, but also to other compatible networks. And one of its most recent updates is compatibility with the Ethereum network through Anulls. Guys, with Nulls it is now possible to do a lot of things. There's NFT platform, there's a decentralized wallet, there are swaps and much more in the Nulls project. And today, I want to bring you a very cool thing that was developed by the people of the Nabox wallet, that is precisely the ID, as we can see here by the website id.nabox.io. The idea of this ID service is to simplify the blockchain. Because for example, when you ask for a person's wallet address, and tell them, send me your wallet, you can't spell the wallet address. On the other hand, if you have your own domains, such as .eth, .bab and others that also exist, you simply end up simplifying the whole process. And that's the idea. Gather all the necessary information in one place. For example, what is the email? Is this email really verified? Yes, it's verified because it's registered inside the blockchain. And what is the official Twitter? Here, this is Twitter, and it's verified. So all this also serves as a way for you to avoid scams. Guys, the amount of people impersonating me on social media is huge. So on Telegram there are many scammers impersonating me, and on Instagram the amount is so huge that I can't even count. So every day a new VoIPA appears. So this Nabox ID service, can be used as an identity on the Web3. And as I told you before, gathering all the public information, both Web2 and Web3, in just one place. And with that making people's lives much easier, and also helping with this issue of fake profiles. So now enough stalling, and let's start creating our digital identity. Well, the first step is to access our Nabox wallet, and look for NullSwap in decentralized applications. Now we connect the Nabox to the original Nulls network and then just change nulls4. Let's choose a token down here that is the Nabox. So it's here. Let's change nulls for Nabox. That'll be about 354,000 Nabox. Confirm the transaction, check the wallet too, and confirm again. However these Nabox coins need to be on the Anulls network. That is an EDM compatible network. And it's precisely this network that is used to create the decentralized identity. Then accessing our Nabox wallet again, let's click on Bridge. Now here we need to follow some steps. We need to change our Nabox tokens that are on the Nulls network, for the Anulls network. So at the top we'll keep the Nulls network, and at the bottom we choose Anulls to change networks. And what token? Here in Assets we choose the Nabox token. I'm going to put it here to make the swap with the maximum amount, and in the sequence I'm going to click Next. I confirm here in the Nabox, and that's it. Now just wait for confirmation. So just a few minutes later, our swap was confirmed. So let's see how our Nabox wallet is. As we can see the Nabox that existed in the Nulls network has already been sent to the Nulls network. 349,000 Nabox. Now let's see if this is enough to create our digital identity. Pay Nabox, registration fee. It is exactly 3 million Nabox tokens. That's about $18 according to CoinGecko. Well, looks like it won't be enough. So let's come back here at NullSwap and do exactly the same thing as before. I'm going to swap nulls for Nabox. So I come here in Bridge and do the same thing as before. Let's make the swap from the nulls network to the nulls network. Which token? Let's select here the token that'll be made this bridge. In this case Nabox. Confirm transaction. Now we are ready to do the procedure. So now guys let's actually create our identity. Up here you click on your Nabox wallet, precisely to swap from the traditional Nulls network to the Anulls network, because it's through this network that identity is created. So now I have 10 Nulls to cover transaction fees, and I have 3 million Nabox to pay for this identity creation. Let's go back here on the Nabox website and go to the menu that says Identity. We're already in the Anulls network. Let's click on Generate Nabox ID. Up here guys, you put VoIPA because I'm the one who's indicating to you. And down here I'm going to put VoIPA because I'm the one creating it. But you must put your own name as you wish. For example, Bitnoob at Nabox. So you put the name you want. Up here is who is indicating. 
Now we click on create, and we sign this transaction in the Nabox wallet. A fee of 3 million Nabox will be charged. So let's confirm. Half of all Nabox tokens that you paid in fees will be burned. So this ends up helping to make the Nabox token a deflationary token. Now let's confirm the fee here in the wallet. That'll be debited from the NLs network. Now just wait here for some confirmations. Ready, we just created our digital identity. So here appears the address compatible with the Ethereum network, and underneath a public key that is the basis of asymmetric cryptography, and that serves to create other blockchain addresses. Here it's still possible to change the profile picture through an NFT avatar. Very cool isn't it? So it's possible to put a NFT avatar on your profile. Remembering that the NFT needs to be on the Anuls, Ethereum, BSC or Polygon network, or else on a compatible network. Then you put here the contract number and all information. Now let's click here on my card. Here appears my Nabox ID card from Web3. So now let's authenticate our Twitter by clicking Authenticate. Let's authorize the application with Twitter and ready. Our Twitter is already verified. It's still possible to check the Discord among others. However as I use my Discord privately, I won't do that now. In addition, there's also the possibility of making the domains. If you have for example a .eth domain, you can enter your identity here. .bit domain, space ID, also has a verification system. We also have BABT here, that are those tokens. If I'm not mistaken, there's a token like that on the Binance exchange. Let's now authenticate the email, contato at vuipa.com. I'm going to click send code and wait for the code to arrive. The code just arrived. 20, 46, 69. Now I'll click on save. Ready, now my email is also authenticated. Now let's take a look to see how our card is getting. At Vopater, that is our Twitter, there's a QR code here, and Voipa at Nabox. If I scan the QR code here, we'll be sent directly to the Nabox ID, and it will show exactly all the information that I already have authenticated. And then, did you like this news? It's a null solution, and that's exactly why this is one of the projects I have in my wallet. I'm currently making a stake and there are several other possibilities for profitability, such as to provide liquidity, do farming etc. That is, there are a lot of possibilities for you to earn with nulls. There are even several videos about it here on our channel. You still don't know? Here on the channel there is a complete playlist, showing all possibilities of staking with full amount, staking with low amount, POCM nulls, and much more. All this aiming to teach you step by step, so it's worth checking out.